Hello people, it's Fox, and guess what today is? That's right, it's a Friday. Oh, it's also my birthday, yay! Pug party, I'm 22 and I have dolls. Okay, how's it going guys? Yes, it is my birthday, I am officially 22. I am so close to dying. Um, so, for my birthday special, I went out and got something I had no expectations of getting. Actually, I went out to get uh, some packs and open them in like a festive way, but I saw this and I absolutely had to get it just because I can automatically get my money back and more. And plus, I'm helping a friend, well, whatever. So I got this for my birthday. I got this for myself. Mind Seize, a Magic the Gathering Commander deck. Let me just go ahead and so you can see all the beautifulness. Look, look at that. There's Gillette, J J Shaving Blades, Nefalia Scourge in her sexy colors. I don't remember what colors these are, uh, so I forgive me. I know it's Bant, Jund, um, whatever, all those. I don't, I don't know what these colors are. So yes, I got this um, just because they had it. Um, I've been to, I got this at Target for MSRP, which is thirty dollars. These things uh, in certain card shops go for like fifty-five to sixty. So these things are pushing a lot of money. There's a card in here that's worth a lot of money that I am selling, and the people who know what it is, I am selling it, by the way. But yes, I'm going to be opening it for you guys because it's just sexy. I actually bought three Commander decks just because the value, uh, but I never managed to get my hands on the good one, which is this one, and I got it, and I'm happy. And yay! Uh, before I open that, I just want to just go ahead and get this, show you that uh, my mom actually got me a really neat uh, birthday gift. Uh, she got me this, a Zelda 3DS that I'm currently playing Pokemon on. <laughs> I got Pokemon for myself. Uh, yeah, I have never owned, well, I had a DSi, but I never actually owned a 3DS because that DSi wasn't mine. Uh, the last Nintendo system I ever owned was an SP, and the last Pokemon game I completed to completion was Yellow. Uh, as you guys can probably tell, I'm not a huge gamer. Uh, I'm not a huge Pokemon gamer, anyway. I'm more of a tabletop, card game kind of guy. Uh, video games, I love video games, but I don't usually have the time to play it. Um... But obviously, this I do have time because I can take it anywhere I go. And I fucking love it. Also, the Zelda 3DS is just fucking gorgeous. Look at that. I did get the game, and I, I have started the Zelda game, but I'm going to play uh, Pokemon before I play Zelda. I play very slowly, so I can never play both at the same time. Uh, but yeah, just thought that would be some neat info. Also, a friend of mine got me some Prismacolors for my birthday and all that fun stuff. But whatever. There we go. Open mind seize. Seize the mind. Okay. So let's open this up. This thing is worth... A good amount of money, and honestly, if I kept the seal in a couple, in not even a couple years, maybe like a year, it'd be money. But then it would be no fun because I don't get to, I don't, you guys don't get to see me open it and enjoy, and enjoyment, enjoys. All right, so let's get this cunt out. Get out of here! Come on, Gillette or Jaleva or. Shaving Blades, Nefalia Scourge. I'm calling her Shaving Blades because Jaleva sounds like Gillette. Oh, uh, yeah, there she is. Looks exactly like Lady Gaga. For all you Lady Gaga fans out there. Why? Okay, and we got our other two commanders here. Uh, Nukus, Nekus, the dude from Game of Thrones. And Thraxmundar. What the fuck's with these names? <laughs> Thraxmundar. There you go. There's a guy. He exists. Yeah. All right. So if you don't know what Commander is, it is a format of Magic: The Gathering that I absolutely love. Uh, it is a hundred-card singleton deck, which means your deck must contain. Uh, it's not over. I don't know if it's under. Yeah, I think it has to contain exactly one hundred cards, and one of those cards is your Commander, and your Commander is a legendary creature. Uh, that's why it gives me three jumbo legendary creature dudes because they can be commanders. Uh, you play with one type of every card, so you can only play one copy of every card with the exception of basic lands and you just kinda play and your deck is, the deck cards in your deck revolves around color identity I can't speak today I'm sorry guys I am not good at speaking quickly so here's our I believe this is a hundred cards yeah so we have a hundred cards in here one of them can be our commander we have some literature if you want to follow in the religion of commander or if you want to follow in the religion of magic the gathering I just pissed off a bunch of religious people and Wizards actually gave us a really cool deck box. It's like this. It can hold all these cards and these, but not sleeved. So it'd be nice if they give us 
deck boxes that can sleeve, which they they sell, but it'd be nice if they just give it to us. And here we go. We're gonna start. Well, we're gonna start. We're gonna start and end with our Mind Seize deck, 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 whatever you want to call it. So I'm gonna do it like this because it is a huge pile of cards. That's not bad, right? That's pretty good. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so we got Jellavan Nefalia Scourge. Bitch crazy. Augur Bolas. Fantastic card. I use this in my Malik EDH deck. I have a custom one that I made. Fog Bank. That's a card. Nightscape Familiar. Baleful Strix. This is a good card. It's also freaking beautiful. Look at that. Look at the art. Look at the pores. Okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stop doing that joke because no one gets it. Nivix Guild Mage. Our Guard Gomazoa. I know this is from, uh, I can't even remember the name anymore. I know Emrakul came in the set. I I'm bad with names, guys, I'm sorry. I know, I think this is from that set. Gutter Snipe, again, I also use this in Melek. Echo Mage, oh, this is pretty good. We got, uh, the dude who looks like a basketball player. And that's not racist, it's just a little racist, okay? By the way, these things come with a ton of rares. So, Jace's Archivist. True name, Nemesis. Okay, so this is a card that's worth... I'm not going to say a number here. It's worth a lot of money, and I am currently selling it. So if you want this, unless there's an annotation right here saying I sold it, if there is no annotation, it is still for sale. True name nemesis. I'm going to sleeve this and put it in a top loader because it's worth a lot of money. It's also a friend, fucking fantastic card. Nightmare Hawk. Event Nightmare Hawk. Vampire Nighthawk. What the hell? Uh, Visseling. So these six damage to the player versus number of cards in their hand minus four. Okay, that's a card. Terror Ravager, Diviner Spirit, this came in I think every blue deck, every deck that had blue in it, because I got this in each one, Mnemonic Wall, oh this is the other artwork, sweet I want this, uh, this came, this is in Theros too, but I actually I'm playing one in my deck and it's nice to have the original art, Hooded Horror, can be blocked, if anybody controls the most creatures, alright, here is the uh, smaller version of Nikisar, the Mind Razor, Accuser. Charmarker Devils, another card I play in Malik. It's good. It's really good. Uyo, Silent Prophet. Flying. Return two lands you control to their hands. Copy target, insert source spell. You may choose new. Oh, it's not too bad. Oh man, that is edge though. I just found, I just saw that. Look at that edge wear on that. That's natural edge wear. Thraxmundar! Sounds like a freaking epic Norwegian metal band. Actually, most magic cards sound like an epic Norwegian metal band. <clears throat> Baleful Force. Soul Ring, a fantastic artifact that most um, EDH players play. Uh, this is also... Actually, I don't know if I'm trading or if I'm going to sell that. I think the only card here I'm definitely going to sell is True Name Nemesis. Alright, I got Wayfarer's Bobble. What does this do? Why, don't, why am I saying what does this do? I actually know, know what this does. It's good. Armillary Sphere. Swiftfoot Boots. Good card. Okay, Grixis. Grixis Colors. That's the name. These are Grixis Colors. There we go. Obelisk of Grixis. This is another kind of artifact that comes in all the decks. Uh, it's like an artifact that produces one of three colors. Temple Bell. Each player draws a card. That's a, that's a nice artifact. Eye of Doom! When I have Doom enters the battlefield, each player chooses a non-land permanent and puts a Doom counter on it. It's permanent with Doom counter on it. So it's kind of like a fucking uh, a fate counter thing. Mariari, I have a foil version of this from uh, the vaults. It's a pretty good card. Curse of Inertia. Prop Whoa, probably look at that propaganda. That is a freaking weird artwork. Ooh, that's a good card too. Not bad. Curse of Shallow Graves. Curse of Chaos. Spiteful Visions. Arcade Melee. It's a good card. Price of Knowledge. I'm not going to read the cards out. Just going to do it. Vision Skeins. Soul Manipulation. Uh, Krosis Charm. I love the art on that. The Dragon's Hand. Grixie's Charm. Sudden Spoiling. Again, Art. Dismiss, counter target spell, draw a card. That's good. Illusionist Gambit. Uh, I'm going to read that later. Wild Ricochet, this is in M14, I think. Not M14. Yeah, M14. What am, yeah, it's in M14. 
Annihilate. Short target non-black creature can be regenerated. Opportunity. Also in M13. 14. Fucking night. Sorry guys. Starstorm. Need art. Strategic planning. Infest. Attempt uh, with reflections. That's neat. Ooh, incendiary command. <laughs> Fissure vent and incendiary command. I actually really want cryptic command, but I guess incendiary commands is okay. Pithis. Pithis. This thing. Pithesis. I, I can kind of say it. Cruel ultimatum. Look at the art on that. That is sexy. There's Nico Bolas going. Bitch slapping is the dude. There is always greater power. Decree of Pain. That is a decree of of pain. Army of the Damned. That's a surprising card. Didn't expect to see that. I actually have this card. I was playing it in a Tasa deck, but yeah. Prosperity. Neat art. Love the uh, complimentary colors on that. Skyscribing. Oh, look at the Azorius. Molten Disaster. <clears throat> Alright, so we're up to lands. So we got Akum Refuge. Boj Bojuka Bog. Command Tower. That's a fantastic card. Friend, my friend can use that. Crumbling Necropolis. One of those other three color producing lands. Something else that comes in all the commander decks. Demir Guildgate. Evolving Wilds. Grisha's Panorama. Is that Boiler Works? Obviously plays a Melek. Is it Guildgate? Also playing a Melek. Molten Slag Heap. Opal Palace. Pretty good. Rakdos Car Carnarium? I'm saying that wrong, I know. Rakdos Guildgate. Rupture Spire. Pretty good. Temple of False God. Good. Urza's Factory. This is weird. Okay. Uh, add one to your mana pool. Put a 2 2 assembly work. Card effect creature token. That's well, pretty neat. Uh, Vivid Creek. Vivid Marsh. And I think just basic lands. Yep, so that was the Mind Seas Command Deck. Hope you enjoyed my stuttering mispronunciation of all the cards that are good <laughs> apologize uh yes thank you very much i'm gonna go out and have a happy birthday hopefully after school because i have school on my birthday and that is it for me thank you for watching guys i love you all and i'll see you later bye now